Since 1976, every American president has designated February as Black History Month. It is celebrated in February in the United States and Canada, while in Ireland and the United Kingdom, it is observed in October. Black History Month is an annual celebration of achievements by African Americans and a time for recognizing their central role in U.S. history. We hope you enjoy our presentations of African Americans on this Black History Month. Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Tyler and Parker. Today is Tuesday, February 27, 2024. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge, I pledge allegiance, allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence while we reflect on today's activities and focus on demonstrating our best behavior. Please be seated. Warriors, this is flu season. Remember, washing your hands regularly can help to stop, stop the spread of germs and save yours or someone else's life. Most importantly, if you're really sick, stay home. Here are the innumerable winners for Alaskan Kickball. Adeo, Owen, Adam, Takafumi, Chase, Alden, Elijah, Maverick, Dean, Nasir, Paige, Tony, Blake, Asher, and Angus. Warriors, Coach Darcy will announce the score for the next intramurals after the break when she can determine the weather for inside or outside sports. In case you didn't know, Friday is School Spirit Wear Day. If you want to buy some spirit wear, go to school website, select resource, and select PTO. On the top menu, you will see the school store. You want to wear your spirit wear on green out days when we have home games. Get your yearbook at, online at jostensyearbook.com or give your cash or check to Ms. Lambert in room 809. If you are going to bring in a check, make sure it is payable to Booth Yearbook. Hurry, hurry up, get your yearbook before prices go up. There are only 101 yearbooks left. You'll want to have your book for the signing party on May 10th. Warriors, next week there will be a band concert at 6 p.m. at Macintosh. Make sure you have a ride to take you home. Come out and listen to our Warriors play. Warriors. The first round of the middle school basketball playoffs is tomorrow. Booth will be playing Bennett's Mill at home. The girls will play at 5 and the boys at 6.15. Make sure to come out and cheer on the Warriors. Car riders, while you are waiting on the sidewalk, be on the lookout for your ride. We need to keep the line moving along. Bus riders, for your safety, please remain on the sidewalk while waiting for your bus. Once you get on the bus, you must stay on the bus. Do not get off the bus without the bus driver's permission. Stay on the path to success. Be prepared, prepared accountable, thoughtful, thoughtful and, and helpful. helpful. And now for the character lesson. The eighth grade celebration shirt is on sale now. This shirt is designed for this year's eighth graders. All monies for the shirt go to fund the eighth grade carnival celebration on May 17th. Ask your homeroom teacher about where to order. Two-factor authentication is used by most services that operate using accounts. Two-factor authentication works by sending a code to my email, which I can then enter to verify my identity. Two-factor authentication can protect from and alert you to people attempting to break into your account. Note that two-factor authentication works best when you use different passwords on accounts other than your email. Try to enable two-factor authentication as soon as possible, or your accounts may be at risk. Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Kamaya and Haley with a few words of wisdom. Did you know that the great American poet Maya Angelou was San Francisco's first black woman streetcar conductor? She was also a Creole cook, a dancer, a singer, and an actress. In the early 1960s, she spent a year working with Dr. Martin Luther King before traveling to Africa to work as a journalist. Perhaps it was her time with Dr. King that inspired these words. A solitary fantasy can totally transform one million realities. 
In other words, one person's dream can change the lives of millions of people in a very real way. Dr. King's dream of brotherhood changed the lives of millions of Americans, just as Gandhi's dream changed the lives of millions of people in India. Today, think about Maya Angelou's words. What dreams do you have for making the world a better place? With something to think about, this is Kamaya and Haley. Make it a great day or not, the, the choice, choice is, is always yours. Word of the day, beatific, B-E-A-T-I-F-I-C, beatific, adjective, having a blissful appearance. The woman's beatific smile made her look years younger. Beatific, I dare you to use this word today. Good morning, Booth Warriors. This is Natalia bringing you the weather for today. The high of today will be 71 degrees and a low of 61 degrees with a 20% chance of rain. There will be races today. Tomorrow will be a 75 degrees and a low of 36 degrees. Have a great day, Warriors. You know what time it is? It's time to fill out the survey. To fill out the survey, go to the Warrior folder in Schoology, then click the survey and fill it out. Remember, Warriors, be honest. The yearbook staff needs your information to make our yearbook all about us. Warriors, the seventh grade counselor, Miss Castelli, has given us a challenge. She wants to know if we can help her with the Super Bowl challenge. Before we tell you how, here's some things you should know. One can of soup can feed five children. If there are 1,161 kids in the building and all of us brought one can of soup, we could feed 5,805 kids. That's a lot of hungry children we can help. You can bring more if you want. More than one if you want. We have until this Friday, February 16th. <laughs> Teachers, you can bring you can bring a can of too. Give it to your homeroom teacher, and the homeroom teacher with the most cans will win a prize. So what do you say? Will you bring out at least one can of soup for the BTV Super Bowl challenge? One can of soup. One can of soup. One can of soup. Basketball. Soccer or basketball? Soccer. Basketball. 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 <laughs> 